So moving right along. And then, too, I want to ask this. How important, and I need my people to comment on this. I'm going to show you comments. How important is college in 2023? I want to ask whoever's watching this, give me an answer. How important is college in 2023? You got fucking chat GP. Jack, I'm sorry, you have chat GPT, which can literally sit here and I can tell this shit to tell me uh, quantum physics as if I'm a three year old and, and it will tell, it will explain that shit to me. Is college even worth it anymore? Now, Leslie Brown, you have twins in college and I see, okay, this is Leslie Brown. She has twins in college. Shout out to her. That's a. Oh, shit, wrong button. God damn it, Les. I don't mean, I didn't mean that. Uh, shout out to her, two twins in college. Leslie, how important is college right now? How, how important do you feel that college is? It's not unless you major in certain professions. I would agree. You say it's very important. Okay, when you say that college is very important, Reek, what are we what what are we talking about? Is this just from a social aspect or or what are we what are we talking about here? You have a successful cut. I'm I'm not saying it's not worth it. I'm asking you if it is in this time. You talking to us yeah, you're talking to a successful college grad that's telling jokes and talking to strangers on a live stream. I don't even practice in my profession anymore reek i'm not i haven't worked as far as in over two years you know what i'm saying let me see i just want to know if college work to see what kind of person you're dealing with if they went to college even though it didn't matter you know they'll work hard eh. nah, i know some lazy motherfuckers that went to college uh, i can tell you that now no educational Jeannie Jeannie is laughing. Shout out to Jeannie Jeannie pulling back up on us. Yes, Chat GPT can teach you coding. They have YouTubes that can teach you coding. And I just I just want to know. Now, I, you talking to a guy, I came out of farm school in 2002. I started my college journey in 1995. We, we talked about a rapidly evolving system you know with artificial intelligence now uh you you have social media i'm talking yo i came out at a different time i came out and old two people were still going to the movies and actually watching television shows they don't do that shit anymore that profession built your foundation yes it did yes it did i i yeah i agree but i was already silly so would I have talked about anything? And y'all got to quit bringing this back to me, right? I, For me, college was a great experience, you know what I mean, to get me from the south side of Chicago to where I am today, right? If a kid from the south side asked me, should they go to pharmacy school, I'm going to say no because those opportunities are limited. These stores are fucking closing. What what do we do now? Is it better to tell people to just do what they love to do and take it serious? You said AI is not taking over pharmacy. Why? How do you figure that? How do you figure that? I mean, because, you know, one of the things in pharmacy, well, you know, we would do compounds that that kind of helps us where well, we would mix different drugs, you know, do specialty drugs. But the AI can help in assessing uh, drug utilization reviews. The AI can help in doing prior authorizations. The AI can help in doing uh, verification of <laughs> medication. Uh, it can speed a lot of shit up. And you know, people will come to the pharmacy, but they just want to get their shit and get up out of there. They don't want to talk to your ass. Yeah, people going to college, I, I kind of believe that. Just say they went not even working a job that they went to school for. A lot of people are doing that. And I'm a 
proud college graduate of HBCU. Well, maybe we just need to go to college for those specialty things. Like you want to be a physician, an attorney. Uh, that's what we go to school for. No longer can we waste money on an art degree. No longer can we waste money on some type of bit. I, I don't know. And I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings that's watching this, but I'm just talking real shit right now. And and we need to know. We need to know. But the state of retail pharmacy is wild. 